Yeah, yeah, yeah. Blaze one for the nation. I got lyrics to wake up spirits. They show me how to. What's going on guys and gals? Travis here, trainaggressive.com, travisstetzel.com, and here I am. Um, it is an off training day, and I am just cooking up my last meal of the day, and uh, I got some vegetables cooking up, well, broccoli, steamed broccoli, and then I also got, I think there's like two pounds of grass-fed uh, beef that I'm cooking up right there, just... Uh, Cooking it up with uh, some mushrooms sliced up in there. I threw in some coconut oil to help cook it up. But uh, this is basically my last meal of the day on a non-training day. So I'm keeping it pretty basic. Um, as you'll read in the uh, blog post, is uh, this last meal, you make it pretty big. Because this is your last meal until your next meal on the next day. And if you're fasting, that's about 16 plus hours, depending on how long you're fasting for. Me, I'm typically fasting for about 15, 16 hours. And uh, if I'm going to be training in between, I want to make sure I'm getting some good quality foods in. And I'm getting in a lot of it. Okay, so this meal you can kind of go to town on. You can have as much as you want. It isn't um, uncommon for me to eat almost all that beef. Um, sometimes I usually have about 16 ounces of that. Um, I'll probably eat about half of that. And uh, I'll just throw it, throw it on top of the broccoli. And I got my usual fixings. I got sauerkraut. I am going to throw some feta cheese on there. Apple cider vinegar and then salsa. I rarely ever use the cheese, but uh, hey man. I'm not 100% paleo. I'm going to throw a little bit of cheese on there, add a, some nice little flavor there. But uh, some other things I'll throw in there, and uh, I'll be tossing it in with this meal too, is some fresh pumpkin. Okay, so just pumpkin in the can, pop it open, put a little pumpkin on the side, and uh, then I top everything off with some spices. We're good to go. And that's my last meal of the day. And like I said, um, typically going pretty heavy on this meal eating a lot of food because like I said you might have quite a bit of time in between this meal and the next and you want to make sure you're properly fueled up um, especially if you're training tomorrow so loading up on the uh, good carbs the good starches sometimes I'll have a sweet potato with this meal um, I'll mix it up I'll have chicken fish and uh, you know different uh, lean meats like that but uh, other things I can't really think of right now. Um, keep it pretty basic. Um, sometimes if I get hungry a couple hours later, because it is only about 6.46, so I usually try to have my last meal at 9 o'clock. Okay, so if I'm, if I'm starving, hungry, I'll throw in another meal. I'll usually get in um, maybe a little bit of almond butter, handful of nuts, or I'll eat a small little meal like this so a bunch of mixed greens some more uh, ground beef maybe some fish some chicken whatever I just make sure I'm ready and I'm, I'm satisfied and uh, you know I end the day off right so this is the last meal non training day that's how we do it keep living aggressive getting strong Travis I'm out